the hair. Intros are awkward. Intros are awkward. Hey, what's up you guys? It's Rachel. So if you didn't see last week's video, my dog Stella and I made a cute little minimalist style paw print painting together. And on the bottom, I wrote her name in calligraphy. So after that video, I had a couple requests to show you guys how to make the calligraphy letters. So I thought, sure. <laughs> so the type of calligraphy that I usually do on pieces like this is kind of a fake calligraphy kind of thing. I am by no means like a cursive writing expert or anything, but I do love making these hand-drawn letters and it's kind of more of a modern calligraphy style. This is just an easy way to fake it. Fake it till you make it. First, you're going to take your paper and write the words you want with pencil so you can change placement, size, and spelling if you need to. Then you're going to go over the pencil with a fine tip marker. To give your letters the calligraphy look, you're going to have to find the downward stroke in each cursive letter. This is the part we want to make into a thicker black line. You can choose to write your name, a positive reminder, or really any word you want to display. I'm writing lyrics from mine and my boyfriend's song. So cliche, I know. Continue thickening all the downstrokes in each letter. Be sure to follow the letter's natural curve. With practice, your folk calligraphy will fool anyone into thinking you know what you're doing. <laughs> So as you guys can see, that kind of modern calligraphy is so easy. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel to join the club. We meet on Thursdays. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Outros are awkward too. Outros are awkward too.